Her home match for the Spokane Velocity now less than 24 hours away. And Peter Choi, the team announced just a few hours ago, tickets are sold out. Yeah, there are uh, all 5,000 tickets are sold out already. And seats you see right behind me there will be filled with the Velocity fans cheering for the first victory. The moment that Spokane has been waiting for. Spokane's ready for this, and Spokane needs this. The Spokane Velocity's first home match is just around the corner. And Riley, with the Velocity, says she's feeling the hype. And this is a once-in-a-lifetime moment. It's historic. Uh, you know, it's been in the making for a couple years, and the anticipation has built in Spokane. A local bar dedicated to soccer it says fans cannot wait for the game. So they are starting early at 10 a.m. We're uh, having a bunch of people meet up before the game here tomorrow morning, open up, have some beers, have some breakfast, yeah. and then uh, about 12.45, 1, we'll march on down to the stadium. Here's what you need to know before the match tomorrow. Bring only necessary items that can fit in your pockets if possible. If you want to grab food or drinks at the game, don't bring cash. Only credit cards and mobile payments will be allowed. Spokane Falls Boulevard. Parking could be a challenge tomorrow. One of the most important things we can emphasize is park downtown and walk. Uh, parking downtown could be six dollars, seven dollars, uh, but it's going to be the safest, the cheapest way to do that. Uh, so park downtown, walk through the park. Uh, it's about an eight-minute walk. For the historic game, they are taking drone photos with fans. Get this: the first 500 fans will be getting a copy of these photos. Make sure to be at the stadium at 1:45. Come on down and hang out. It's going to be a good time. And Derek, starting at 1 p.m. tomorrow, these fans will be start marching from Riverfront Park. I'll also be there, so be there or be square. And last but not least, go Velocity. Back to you, Derek. <laughs>